Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, for those of you who don't know. And for today's video, we're gonna be testing out fellow YouTuber Christian Dominique's makeup line, Dominique Cosmetics new lipstick. That was a mouthful to say. So she did come out with a nude lipstick line, a whole collection, and y'all know I love my nude lipsticks. So I had to go ahead, purchase this, put these to the test, show you guys some swatches, show it to you on my lips so you guys could see how it looks and if you guys are interested in getting any colors. I did purchase this with my own money. I just really, really love my nude lipsticks and when I saw them, I was like, I need them all. They're all so beautiful. So I'm very excited to go ahead and test this out. But first off, I just want to shout her out and say I have been watching her for such a long time. I love her. She really seems so sweet and so genuine. Um, I'm part of the Dom squad. I love her. So I just want to shout her out and say I'm so, so proud of you for another amazing launch. And I'm very excited to test these products out. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started, guys. Right, so I did purchase the whole entire bundle. So it does come with its own makeup bag. How cute is this? It's just a plain makeup bag. It is black and it does have rose gold detailing as you guys can see. So it does say DC right over here, which is Christian Dominique and it is Dominique Cosmetics and it does say Dominique on it. And I think it's really cute. Rose gold detailing, it does say DC on the little chain over here. That is like her logo. So I feel like it's a really good quality bag really good to store like makeup products in your purse or anything else so i'm really really liking that it did come with this the whole line did include four lip liners that i have here and then it also did come with six lipsticks so i have all of them i know it's excessive but i love my nudes let's be real and then it did come with a little card which i think is really cute it says thank you for supporting dominique cosmetics we hope you enjoy your purchase all of our products are created with our love for color and quality we would love to hear from you and see all of your creativity at dominique cosmetics so really really happy i want to show you guys the packaging so i'm a really big like fan of packaging packaging and I actually really really like her packaging really sleek it does say DC on it this is the lip liner again there are four of them so this is what it looks like it is a matte black and then it is sort of embossed it is sort of raised a little bit and I just really think the packaging is really nice specifically on the lipsticks I really like how they incorporated the rose gold on there as you guys could see this one is definitely more rose gold than the liner so I am a fan and then Ooh, let's not break it already Melissa um, it does say on here which I think is so cute I am such a lipstick lover you guys don't know I have so so much lipstick but I love lipstick so much um, one of her like quotes she's really inspirational every single time she does a video she ends off the video with a quote um, one of the quotes that are on all the lipsticks it says know your worth and then add lipstick that is so cute it is great I'm a, such a lipstick lover so I think that is just adorable and really really true know your worth and throw on some more lipstick because who doesn't love lipstick you know but first off we're gonna go in with the shade nudie and this is what the packaging looks like it is pretty standard black base clear top I like how it is a clear top so you can see the color right at the top and then another sort of really unique thing, I know Patrick Todd did this. I think this is really bold because some people love it, some people hate it. This is what the actual pencil looks like. So you guys could see it is sort of like a triangle. I actually like this because I feel like with that triangle it's actually really easy to outline your lips but it's also really easy to fill them in so if you're somebody who likes to fill in your lips I feel like you're gonna like this it's gonna be really good for shading filling in your lips and even outlining so I'm actually a fan of this design right here ooh that's a really really pretty brown color it is sort of deep but I feel like it looks really really nice a perfect nude not too warm not too cool it is like the perfect color then we have 
have the shade Crush, but this one looks a little bit more pinky right off of the bat. They feel really, really creamy. Yeah, so you guys could see that one has more of a pink undertone, which is this one right over here. Sort of similar, but this one's just a tiny bit more pink. Next shade we're going into is Dulce. Ooh, I love that one. That one is like a little bit of like a peachier undertone, but I feel like that is really, really pretty. This is basically my kind of nude for every single day. I really, really love this color. That's really, really nice. And then the last one that we have is a brown sugar. Ooh, that one's a really, really pretty deep brown shade. That looks really, really gorgeous. So it definitely is deeper than the nudie shade. Definitely the deepest out of all four of them, but it's really, really pretty. It's not like too deep that if you're fair, it's gonna look too dark. That is just such a beautiful nude color. So I'm really, really a fan of that. That looks stunning. What I think I'm gonna do is take a look at the lipsticks and try to pair it with one of the lip liners to see how it looks. So um, that's what we're gonna do. But I actually really, really love all of them. It felt really, really nice on my hands. And I feel like it's gonna look really, really pretty on lips. I love these nudes. Like I'm such a nude person, y'all. So I'm excited. So first shade we're gonna go into is Kayate. But this is what the packaging of the lipsticks look like. So it is just a plain black packaging. It does say DC right at the top, which is cool. It also has a magnetic closure, which is nice. I like that. And I'll swatch it on my hand and then on my lips. Oh, that's a really pretty shade. I feel like that would go good with the Dulce lip liner. Yeah, so I'm gonna use the Dulce lip liner and I'm going to outline my lips. Okay, so I feel like it's gonna be kind of difficult to see on camera. I hope you guys are gonna be able to tell, but that's actually a really, really pretty color. I kind of did have to go over it a few times just because I felt like it is sort of light on me, but put this on this is a really really pretty nude that feels incredibly creamy so creamy it's definitely not gonna be kiss proof I can already tell really really nice I feel like this is a really good nude for every single day I'm not even gonna lie I love the color I feel like it is a great neutral nude next we're gonna go into the shade nude cocoa Again, same exact packaging Ooh, that shade looks really, really beautiful. That is a really, really beautiful shade. That's gonna go with that brown sugar shade so nicely. So I'm gonna take the shade brown sugar and outline my lips. See, this one automatically, you can see, because it's not as light as that Douce color. That was really easy to outline. That was really, really nice. All right, so we have the shade Nude Cocoa paired with the Brown Sugar Lip Liner. That is stunning. This is a really, really beautiful combination. Again, it feels really, really creamy. I feel like this is a good nude for like fall and winter. I really, really love this color. I would rock this. I'm a fan. I really, really like this. Next up, we're gonna go in with the shade Pretty Natural. Ooh, this looks like a really, really nice shade as well. So watch that here. Ooh, that's pretty. That's very, very peachy, but more so on the cooler side. That's definitely a little bit warmer. That's a really, really nice color. I feel like that would pair with the nude lip liner. So let's go ahead, nudie, I'm sorry, with the nudie lip liner. So let's go ahead and outline our lips. Yeah, see this one you can even tell more so than the Dulce lip liner that I used. That one is definitely more so lighter, but this is a really, really pretty color. So again, we are going in with the shade Pretty Natural. This is a perfect everyday color. You could go in with a lighter lip liner. I like it with this one though, because it does add a little bit more definition because this is a pretty light color. I feel like it still looks really, really pretty. I feel like this is great for every single day. It definitely is a more natural nude. Definitely am a fan. I thought that this shade would be a little bit too light on my lips. I feel like it's really not that light. It doesn't look too bad. So I actually really, really like this color again. Same exact formula. Very, very creamy. Feels really, really nice on the lips. Okay, my lips are getting a little red now. Getting a little irritated. Next, we're gonna go in with the shade Sweet Nectar. And something that's actually really cool that I just noticed is on the little like flap over here, it says know your worth and add lipstick right here. That's actually really, really cute. This might be too light. So, ooh, that's very pinky. Ooh, I like that color. 
I feel like that's gonna go with that lip liner that we just used, the Nudie. Let's go in outline with Nudie. We have Nudie on, and we're gonna go in with Sweet Nectar. Ooh, yeah. This one I feel like is a little too light, so I may go in with the Dulce liner just to make it a little bit more warm. I feel like it still looks really pretty. Add a gloss on top, it looks very, very natural, so I'm not hating it. I would actually probably pair this with Pretty Natural, so do Pretty Natural and then do Sweet Nectar right in the center for more of an ombre effect. I feel like that would look really pretty. Next up, we are going to go into the shade She's a Tease, and ooh, that's a really, really pretty sort of like mauve pinky color that looks stunning oh that is beautiful that I would wear that color all the time that is like my type of mauve color that's gonna go with the crush lip liner I feel like that's gonna look beautiful so let's outline this is like my everyday kind of lip liner I feel like it's beautiful um, I would probably wear this every single day fill in my lips with it and then put a gloss on top I really really like the lip color um, again we're going in with she's a tease I love this this is my literally I probably wore a mauve nude lipstick every single day when I was first getting into lipsticks this is like my go-to color I love mauve nudes this is like the perfect not too deep not too light mauve I really really like the color again I would wear this every day I really really like this love it in conjunction with that lip liner I love this color this is definitely one of my favorites Honestly, this is a lipstick I was probably the most excited for. This is the shade Freckles. I think this is the one that like initially drew me in and I was like, I need that color, it looks stunning. This is what the lip color looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it. That's really, really pretty. That I feel like can go with this shade or this shade. I kinda wanna go in with that first shade. I think this was Nudie. The last shade again is Freckles. I love this shade. I love this shade. It's dark, not too dark. Probably one of my favorites, truthfully. I really, really liked this. I really, really liked the mauve shade, and I really, really liked that first shade that we used to. So those are like my top favorites, but I feel like this looks really, really pretty. Again, perfect for every single day. All right, guys, so you have seen the lipsticks in action on my hand. I'll swatch, I'll show you guys one last look. And then you have also seen them in action on my lips. First off, let me know your favorite color down below. I really, really love all of them, but I wanna give you guys my truth, honest opinion on the collection. So, I feel like the colors are beautiful. I feel like there was a lot of thought put into the colors. There's really a nude for everybody here. I like, again, how they're not too cool, not too warm. I feel like for a first launch, I don't know if she's gonna come out with more, but I feel like for a first launch, she came out with a lot of basic good colors that would go with a lot of skin tones. Like, if you are fairer than me, you can rock all these. If you are deeper than me, you can rock all these. I really like the formula thus far. It feels really, really Really creamy on the lips not really thick it doesn't feel like you have like lipstick on your lips it kind of just feels like your lips but like creamier they feel really really moisturizing on my lips didn't dry out my lips they feel very very creamy and then also the lip liners I actually really really like the lip liners I feel like you can fill in your lips with it you can outline your lips with it throw a gloss on top use them as lipsticks themselves and I feel like it's amazing so line your lips with them I actually really like the shape it made it really really easy to outline makes it really easy to shade. I love shading my lips, so I typically always do that X right at the cupid's bow, and I do fill them in on the corners, and then right in the center, I do fill it in a tiny bit, and I feel like that just helps with also making your lips look pretty full. I actually really like this whole collection. I really love all the colors. I definitely have those three favorites that I'm like obsessed with. I really love the products. Definitely gonna be using them in future videos every single day. I'm very, very happy for Christian. Like that is amazing. I really, really love Dominique Cosmetics. Again, let me know your favorite color down below or if you've tried this collection out. I would love to hear your thoughts. So I hope that you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, please don't forget to subscribe before you go if you do like what you see so you can be part of the ATFB fam. ATFB, all things fashion and beauty, and if you hit that post notification bell, you will get notified of all my future uploads. I usually do upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, but I hope that you guys are well and that you guys are safe, and I will see you guys in a few days in my next video. Bye!